back to my channel. I figured I would hop on here and start up another vlog. I'm gonna set you guys down right there. I made a coffee, I made this mug. I didn't make the mug, I painted the mug. Um, but it's kind of speckled and I decided to do a black handle and I just put a G under it too. Um, I had to share it. Um, I just filmed, I can't talk. <laughs> when can I ever talk? Um, I just finished filming a full face makeup look using all milk makeup products. So it's my second coffee of the day. I don't think it's working. So. I have an insane amount of PR boxes to get through or packages to get through. I've pretty much unboxed them all, but I have to film so many videos, take a lot of photo content, and kind of prioritize. So I have a lot to do today. Um, not sure if this vlog is going to be entertaining or not, but I'm pretty much going to be working. Okay, I already did my errands for the day. I am going to start working on my blog. I have a blog post to write. My website is launch launching soon. If it is past June 1st, by the time you guys are watching this video or by the, by the time I upload it, um, my website and blog is launched and you guys can go take a look at it. Everything will be linked below. Um, lots of exciting things coming soon. So make sure you stay tuned for that. But I have a little hint for you guys. I made an Instagram page all about it. Um, which I will also link below, so make sure you guys follow that if you are interested. Lots of things to do to prepare for everything. So I'm going to clean up all of this milk makeup, put it away, get my beauty room clean again, and I'm going to start working. Hi, hi, hello. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys my new shelf. I built this the other day, and I think it's actually, I think it actually included me building this in a vlog the other day, but... It's finally complete. I painted the stand that my sister made this painting for me. Um, it's like the Friends. Um, what the heck is that called? The Friends, you know, the Friends thing. She did Sisters instead of Friends. Um, super cute. And the easel was like a really, really light brown that I did not like in here. Um, so I painted it white. And yeah, so it's all complete. It's super cute. I love this little section of my beauty room. So yeah, I just want to show you guys. This is my PR bin. And I, we're going to sit like this. Um, this is my PR bin. I have to go through everything in here. And I am going to write down exactly what needs to get done in what order, um, what's pressing, what isn't, what I've had for a while and just haven't been able to film. Um, so that is my first step today. I got to prioritize everything and then schedule days of when I am getting all of these things done. Lots of content to create for all of this and, um, that's pretty much a day in my life. So I figured I would show you guys that. Um, so yeah, I'm going to start figuring that out. All right. So what I do is I take my day planner and a notebook and I kind of just go through everything that I need to do and yeah. So I have finished organizing what I'm going to do and when I'm going to do it. <laughs> um, so super happy about that. I'm back on my schedule, which I'm happy about. So I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about this company that I get tea from. Um, they're honestly amazing and I love them so much. So I'll just show you the tea I have right now and the little bottle that they gave me. So the brand is called Teamy and this is like a little tea tumbler. So what you do is you take the lid off you. If you have loose tea, you can put it right in here. Or I have the 
actual bag, so I just put it directly in there. And I fill it up with, I can separate that. I fill it up with water, I put my tea bag in, and I let that sit until it's like not scolding hot. And then once it's cooled down a little bit, I will put it back in the attached bottle and put my lid on and then it's good to go for wherever I am going. I'm huge on tea. You can also use this as an iced tea tumbler. So you can cool your tea, put it in the fridge and then obviously take the bag out, fill it up with ice and then it's good to go for that too. The tea I use is the chai tea and I love chai tea so much because I put oat milk in it. Just wanna show you guys the tea I love and how great it is. They also have so many different color tumblers. They actually have, they have like a light pink, purple, blue, I think yellow, they have a bunch. Then they also have like metallic colors. I think there's gold, rose gold, and silver, I believe. Um, I will link their website down below for you guys. Um, but it's honestly amazing. I love it so much. I am a huge tea person. I'm also a huge coffee person, but you can use this for coffee too. You can use this for literally anything. Go take it with you in your car. Not that you have many places to go right now, but even at home, I don't like drinking just out of regular glasses. I like drinking out of all my tumblers. So this really helps because you can use it hot or cold. So after going through all of my PR packages, I realized that there's a bunch of things in there that I know you guys would take interest in. I got a lot of requests from you guys about how I get all the volume in my hair. And I normally use a tease and comb and hairspray. But this company, Hair Shark, sent me a pro back comber and it's pretty much, oh my god, it looks like shark fins. That's cool. Um, but it's pretty much just like my hair teaser, but I feel like this is way more legit. <laughs> um, so you can part your hair with this side and then you just like back home as you normally would. I'm actually going to use it right now because I feel like it's like glued to my head right here. So I will just show you guys what I do since. So you guys see how this is like completely flat on my head. That's why like I love volume. So putting this, my hair up like this, this adds that extra volume. But that's not always gonna stay there. So we have to add volume into the roots. So I take my hairspray, you can use any hairspray. I use level four um, strength. So it's not, not, it's not the strongest strength where it's gonna like make your hair crispy. Well, it could just spray from a distance, but this is the level I use. And you kind of just go from far back, spray like an inch away from the root, cause that's where you're gonna be back combing. And then you take, I'm gonna take the side of the bristles and just back them. So you go, whoa, holy crap. What, what the heck, look at that. That was insane. Okay, so that was awesome. Okay, so then I'm gonna go above it cause it's kind of flat here and then goes out. So then you just go higher up. And you can also part with this. I just normally do it with my finger. Um, spray a little more and do the same thing closer to the root so as you guys can see it's a lot more volume so then I'm gonna take this side and just brush so I'm gonna angle it and just brush through literally the top layer of strands just to smooth it out so like, look how much volume that gave compared to this side. Um, so thank you so much to Hair Shark for sending me one <laughs> because I've actually broken my other ones. This is like super heavy duty, so I'm really liking that. So just like that. And the top layer. You can add as much hairspray as you want. You don't need to do hairspray, but I would highly recommend using hairspray. Um, it just holds better, um, at least with my hair. So last but not least, I'm gonna show you guys a lip balm. I really like this brand because one, it is from my hometown. It's where I'm from. Completely organic, healthy ingredients, and she has like awesome flavors. Scents? Flavors? I don't know. I got a lavender lip balm, and then I also got a chocolate lip balm. Uh, I actually ended up giving my lavender lip balm to a family member because they love the smell of lavender, and I was good with the chocolate. So it is, it looks like chocolate, 
It smells delicious. It doesn't go on brown. It's just a lip balm, but it smells like chocolate and it's super cute and it's organic. So definitely check out Nat's Organic Lab. They're the cutest. They're super aesthetically pleasing too, which is a huge thing for me. But yeah, if you guys need some lip balms, definitely check her out. The products I showed you guys in this video, I will link below for you guys. Hey guys, so I just wanted to show you a package I got in the mail. Um, it seems super interesting and I've never used it before. So I kind of want to try it out. I've seen a lot of people use this product. I'm going to test it out. So I figured I would do that on the vlog. So it's an ultrasonic scrub device and it looks like this. And it's by Touch Beauty. So this is what came in the box. This is the actual device. And it says here turn it on and then this you slide up it says sliding intensity adjustment bar so whoa oh my god let's just bring that down okay so it's on i have not read the instructions because like i never do but that was just like a little silicone lid and it's like, oh, I think oh, that back. Okay, before we test it out, I'm just gonna see what's in the rest of the box. Oh, oh, like a stand, but I think you can like charge it. A charging stand. That's really sleep. I also apologize for the lighting. It is nighttime, so I'm going to bed, so I figured I would just like kind of add this into my skincare. Yeah, so that's just like a little charging stand, which is really cool. I like that it has that. And then it has a little accessories box. I'm super interested in this product. Okay, so a pouch, I guess, if you want to take it somewhere with you. And then the charger, which is just a basic little like USB input charger. Before you use the appliance, remove your makeup and cleanse the skin. Charging the appliance, use the USB charging cable to connect to the wireless charging base. The cleansing function, you're gonna be using it like this. So you see the angle of this brush? It's gonna be like this on your skin. It's gonna be like that. Um, but the massaging function, you're gonna flip it over and the, where it's flat, that's gonna be the massaging function. Okay, so I'm gonna go wash my face and then we're gonna come back and we are gonna use this. Okay, so now that I washed my face, we are going to use, oh my God, I turned it on, this scrubbing device. So this cleanses your skin. So um, if you guys can see from the picture, it's taking out all that crap that's in your pores. So let's see how this works. First we're gonna cleanse and then we're gonna massage. Put it on pretty low because I'm kind of scared. Mm -hmm. There's stuff on there. I don't know if you guys can see that. I hope that's not gross. Again, I'm going on a 30 degree angle as best as I can. Can't be like exact. But they said go up. Wow. So I'm going up the nose as directed. Wow, that's interesting. I'm just gonna show you. I'm gonna go up my chin now. And I know for sure I have like really bad clogged pores on my chin and my nose. It's like the worst place and I can already see. Wow, that's like so cool. So the point of putting moisturizer on or um, a face oil before using this is to, to help this glide easier and you gotta make sure you do that. 
because you don't want to be stretching or pulling at your skin. So, wow, this feels amazing. It feels smooth. Holy crap. You don't know that it's getting so much, but it really is. Okay, so now we're done with the cleansing. We are going to do the massaging. That was really cool. I definitely hate when you can see the, all the pores, like all the bumps on my nose through my foundation or my makeup. And I feel like this, doing this daily would really help that feels amazing okay so now we're gonna do the massaging okay so for the massage I just turned the bar up all the way um, and we're just gonna go on the flat side and move slowly as it directs this feels like a facial at home It feels so relaxing. Like, I can't even tell you. I could fall asleep. I wish someone was doing this for me. <laughs> okay, guys, so I'm gonna end the video here. Um, I am ready for bed. That was definitely gonna be a new addition to my skincare routine. Make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell to get notified every time I upload, and I will see you guys in my next video.